You're watching The Curse of Oak Island in a Russian. We're recapping the Season 9 episode, Behind the Quest. So what happened? Be forewarned, it's not a real episode this week, just a Maddie Blake recap. So let's do a recap episode of a recap episode of a show that's already 50% recaps. History. In Season 1, they had one production trailer, and now there are four. We also learn there is nothing more important to Rick and Marty than the show's integrity, which fails to explain why they keep showing Xena's thoroughly discredited map. Danger. Remember that time they sent a diver into 10X and how he got stuck for a bit before he returned to the surface with nothing? Or how about the time a diver descended into C1 but then got put into a decompression chamber after he returned to the surface with nothing? Tragedy. We relive the tragedy of when four members of the Rustall crew died in 1965. And then the exciting time Lee Lamb showed the team the 1704 stone. And then the extra exciting time Rick Rustall was presented with the toy gun they found. Unexpected. While digging for the chapel vault in season 5, a vacuum hose once exploded, killing no one. And then this one time there was a cave-in at H8 and Rick wandered over to it with a rope tied around his waist, also killing no one. Disease. In Season 5, Rick takes his shirt off on camera and shows us his Lyme disease rash. And then he went to the pharmacy to get medicine. Motivation. Rick one time gave a speech in the war room that made him cry, and then everyone else started to cry. So far as I know, while filming this, no shirts were removed. Tune in next time when we learn the real threat on Oak Island isn't the deer tick, but the dynamite. <laughs> I went there. Sorry, no new episode this week. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. But if you enjoyed whatever this is, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe, watch the old episodes, leave a comment below, and I'll be back again, hopefully with a new episode, next week.